technical colleges, they're all about workforce education, and that's something that happens now. You have to prepare students right now. So Design Build promises to shrink down that time frame and get the facility that's there to prepare students online faster. My name is Ross Whitehead. I'm the principal in charge for Schreiber Starling Whitehead Architects, and I was the design manager on this project. So my name is Dennis Flynn. I'm a construction project manager for the Department of Enterprise Services. When we do a design build project, if we can get the project delivered faster and have the college more involved, it helps our clients meet their mission. My name is Chuck Davis. Uh, I'm the Executive Director of Facilities and Operations for Bates Technical College. One of the early requests from the college was help us with our parking problems. In downtown Tacoma, parking around the college is at a premium, and so having the design build team create additional parking for us was a huge gain. Well, my name's Mike Curran. I'm the Senior Project Manager for Walsh. Our biggest challenge on this project was the initial parking issues. We managed to save a portion of the existing ramp and extend a new ramp where the roof parking existed. And then we'd raise the entire building up in our design to provide additional parking spots. In a downtown campus, which can be difficult for some students to access, that made a real difference to the college. Where we can say that our expectations are exceeded is in the delivery of special services. So we had a lot of specialty labs in this building, so we wanted to assure that we had the right designers and installers, and design build really gives you that. It's the architect, the contractor, the trade partners, and they're all involved in design in the very beginning, and we're one team. Shriver, Starling, and Whitehead and the Walsh Group had to work very closely together with us to determine what was critical in the delivery of a healthcare facility for a higher education institution. I feel the benefits of progressive design build is that you're able to coordinate design and construction. It allowed us to find any conflicts and work them out ahead of time rather than being in the middle of construction and discovering them out in the field when we were trying to build the project. Having all the entities together from start to finish helps to build a team environment as well. For me it's you know, building those relationships and getting the project done and you know, being proud of what you did at the end as a team. This was the first progressive design build academic building in the state. Design build is the way that state projects are going to be moving in the future.